Hello, boys and girls. I'm glad you found me. This is Peace Daddy, Mr. Dollar here, and we are on the 17th activity in our unit called Mixtures and Solutions. This is activity number 17, and we've been talking a lot lately about solids, liquids, and gases, which are also known as the states of matter. And today's lesson is called Gases Part 2. The materials that you're going to need are a glass of water, an index card, or a playing card. So here's my glass of water, my index card or playing card, and just for safety, we need a bowl to make sure if we have a spill, that we have something there to catch the spill, just in case. Okay, so the card says that you're supposed to fill the glass with water, cover it with an index card or a playing card, keep your hand on the card as you turn the glass over, and remove your hand from the card. Be sure you have a bowl underneath. And then the question is, what do you observe? Okay, so let's try this out. So here's my playing card, and I'm going to put it onto my glass of water, and I'm going to invert the glass while I'm keeping the playing card held there for just a minute, and then I let go of the card. Okay, so what are you observing there? What's happening? Why isn't the water coming out of the glass? Okay, so I'm going to turn it right side up and let's read the statement on the back. It says the pressure of the air outside the glass is stronger than the pressure of the water inside the glass. This is what prevents the water from spilling. Okay, so we're in our section called gases. So we're thinking about what the gases are doing all around us. And you would think that the water would push down on the card and cause the card to go down and the water would be drawn by the gravity and pull it down and the card would be drawn by gravity and everything would fall. But actually what's happening is when we turn the card and the glass upside down, there's air that's pushing on the bottom of the card and that air is greater than the force of the water pushing down. And there's another little thing going on as well. Water also has an adhesive quality to it. So it is adhering to the top of the glass a little bit, all right? And something that is an adhesive means it's a glue and it's kind of sticky. So we're cheating, but just a little bit of cheating, okay? The, uh, activity and the experiment actually is true. There is more pressure that's pushing up on the bottom of the card that is pushing down. So the gas around us, even though we can easily move our hands through it and solids can move through the gas and water could move through the gas, the gas does have pressure and it does push uh, against us. All right, so that's it. This has been activity number 17. As always, thank you for watching. This is Peace Daddy. I'll see you next time.